Hello and welcome to one of the most atmospheric venues in the game of football, St James's Park. I'm Derek Ray and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Newcastle United facing Manchester City. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Well, we have to say, Stuart, respect and admiration grows for Kevin De Bruyne with each passing year. So many attributes. What are you looking for from him in this game? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-twos around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. And the contest begins... And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson stands between the posts. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Oh, great vision. Foden it is advantage Manchester City here Bernardo Silva here's De Bruyne and he smacks it against the crossbar well I thought that was in Derek he struck it so sweetly plenty of power can't come much closer than that Jack Grealish Joao Cancelo really sitting deep now that could be problematic and Bernardo Silva has it De Bruyne Rodri Grealish and now Rodri moving the ball effectively looking for the right moment Callum Wilson Ball with Sam Maxima. Newcastle moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Options in the middle. Foiling them effectively. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Wilson. Long way out this. Superb block. Foden now with Silva Foden and a long way out well good hands there from the keeper Willock and it's a quality pass it's there for him not the best clearance and a chance for them to nudge in front oh dear not really troubling the goalkeeper at all Stuart well from that range he should be scoring and he knows it well the keeper's made a good save but you just sense a goal is coming soon well, successfully cut out Succeeded in keeping it in play. Early ball in. Well, those stats tell you everything. A tight and cagey game without enough goal mouth action. Both teams need to get more players forward if they're to pose a real threat.
Now a potentially dangerous position for Sissi. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. So the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. Well, for Gabriel Jesus, a performance that he'll quickly want to forget. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Gabriel Jesus. Walker. Rodri on to Silva Foden Rodri Bernardo Silva Foden top class defending Bernardo Silva firing it in Oh, a smart stop. Substitution for Newcastle. Here it is now, a substitution. Number 28, Joe Willock. To be replaced by number 8, John Joe Shelby. Taken short. And played in, and a no-nonsense clearance. Walker cuts it back. And there the attack ends for now. Possession changes hands, the interception there. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Well, is it going to end up being productive for them? Cross could be useful. And a struggle to get it away properly. Grealish. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. A change in the offing for City. Number nine, Gabriel Jesus coming onto the pitch. Number seven, Raheem Sterling. Trying to pick out a teammate. Insufficient accuracy as regards the corner. And space to cross it. Oh, fancy footwork. De Bruyne waiting. Still not clear. Strong play here. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Ritchie. Well, now he's let that run out of play. And it will be a throw-in here. Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball, but their attacking players lack tempo, invention and goal. Something they need to rectify quickly if they're going to win this one. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. In with a chance! Oh, a save of the highest order! Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Well, they're going for the short one. Rodri, cutting the ball back. Interception to snuff out the danger. And breaking at pace with Menace. All in all, a broken counter-attack. Rodri, here's Bernardo Silva. It's opening up for them. 
and a goal! This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Have a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Well, on the attack, hunting for a late equaliser here. And players waiting in the centre. Grealish. And it comes down to the final five minutes. Jack Grealish. Foden. And return to Grealish. And Bernardo Silva has it. Now the conclusion, he's missed the opportunity. Substitution for and they're making a change. Coming off the pitch, number 11, Matt Ritchie, to be replaced by number 12, Jamal Lewis. A message delivered from the referee to the fourth official. Three minutes on the board. Lascelles. No space for them here. Walker. So the final whistle and no cause for celebration in the Magpies camp. What did you make of how it went? Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed. Not a good night's work.